Good morning, class. Miss Tiffy here. Okay, so for today's lesson, we are going to focus on grammar, which is compound noun. So, class, in this lesson, you will need your English Year Six textbook, your exercise book, stationeries, and your eyes and ears. So. For your eyes, I want you to watch this video and ears to listen carefully to understand what is compound nouns. So, at the end of this lesson, you will be able to number one match the correct nouns to create compound nouns, and number two to use the compound nouns correctly and appropriately. So, let's begin. Activity 1, we are going to do mix and match. Okay class, for the mix and match today, I want you to match the nouns from the left box to the right box. Okay? Now, you can pause this video to figure out which words can match the right words. Then, we can discuss the answers after this. Okay, now let's discuss on the answers. Number one, lip. Lip can match to which noun? Yes, lipstick. What is lipstick? Yes, the one that girls or women wear on their lip. Lipstick. Now, number two, drum. Which noun fits correctly to the word drum? Yes, drum roll, meaning the number of sound made on the drum, so we call it drum roll. Very good. Now, number three, sauce. Hmm, sauce pan? Yes, sauce pan. You know, the frying pan you use to cook egg? We call it saucepan. Very good. Then, key, which makes keychain. Very good. The keychain is you use where you hook colorful uh, cartoons or a shape on your key. We call it keychain. Very good. Well done. Now, what we call these? Yes, we call them compound noun. Alright, now let's see what is compound noun. Now, compound noun is... A compound noun is a word that is made up of two nouns. Okay, just like the game we play, Mix and Match, where I ask you to connect the nouns from left to right. So when these two nouns are connected together, they become a compound noun. Okay, then when we pronounce the words, which is the compound noun, the, the sound, okay, the stress is placed on the first noun. Okay, so for example, can you read this word? Yes, photograph. Photograph. Did you hear how I stress the first noun? Yes, so for compound noun, we stress the first noun when we read them. So this one, we say photograph. Very good. Now, for activity 2, now that you know the compound nouns, I want you to tell me where can you spot these compound nouns. Okay class, now look at this diary. Okay, so on this diary, you see there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and seven pictures. Can you tell me 
what are the names of these pictures? These pictures, the name, are made from compound noun. So, read and try to find the answers. We can discuss them later. You can pause the video and try to figure out the answers. Okay? Alright class, now let's discuss. So I'm going to read the diary and you can follow me. Okay? Then we'll find the answers together. Dear Diary, It is the first day of school. I make my bed and brush my teeth with my red toothbrush. After that, I grab my books from the bookshelf and put them in my bag. Don't forget your sunflower pencil case, my mother says. She also packs my favorite chocolate cupcake with sprinkles on top. After kissing her goodbye, I walk to the car and put on my seat belt. Did you get all the answers correct? Well done! Now let's see the next paragraph. You can follow me and read along. I arrived to school at 7.15 in the morning. I waved my father goodbye and walk to the school gate. I see my friends queuing for body temperature check. I wear my superhero face mask to keep myself safe. My teacher makes sure I put on hand sanitizer too. I walk to my classroom and sit on my chair. I cannot wait to start learning again. Well done class. Now that we read the diary and found the answers, did you get all of them correct? If you did, well done. If you don't, it's okay. We can try again. Alright? So the words that I underlined, we call them compound nouns because each noun holds their own meaning. So when they're combined, they make another meaning. Okay? Well done, class. So now, we're going to have homework. So this is where you know we have reached the end of this lesson. Now let's see what is the homework for today. Okay, class. So for today's homework, I want you to match. Then you can fill in the blanks with the correct answer. Okay, if you cannot print out this worksheet, you can write them down in your exercise book from the textbook at page 9. Okay, that is all from me. Thank you for coming to my class. Hope to see you again next Monday.